My primary form of communication is actually through drawing. People usually would write down their days on their journals, but for me, I prefer to draw. So for me, I try to listen to the world and I use that as my inspiration for my journals. I've never felt that I was born to draw. I remember a time in primary school, I was with my best friend. You know, we were trying to draw Transformers. And then I remember that attracted some attention from my classmates. And then they look at my best friend's drawing and say, hey, it's quite nice, ah. Huh? And then they look at my drawing. Their reaction was like, what's that, Sia? I felt like, you know, I was a singer um, who is trying to sing, but is completely tone deaf. And despite what people were telling me, I continued to push on, I continued to keep drawing. So because of that, I am the person who I am today. I don't really have a daily routine per se, but I try to keep it structured just to keep myself sane. For me, usually it's like Mondays, Wednesday, Fridays, it's like painting. And Tuesdays and Thursdays, it's reserved for like, you know, administrative work and meetings. On the weekends, it's reserved for the family. When we went to self-isolation, studio days are out the window and all the projects were cancelled. I was quite lost. So Faris, what do you do then? Hmm, what did I do? Um, so during this period, I didn't get to talk to a lot of people. Despite that, you know, I could still hear laughter, I could still hear conversations. And it was pretty strange because everyone had their masks on, so I have no idea where the sounds were coming from. To me, it's pretty interesting because I felt like if I was in the studio just looking at the canvas the whole day, you know, this is something that I've never seen. The thing about the skirt breaker is like, you know, I'm home all the time and where I'm staying is actually pretty new. I didn't feel like it had its own identity. I've seen a lot of cats popping up around the neighbourhood. I've seen the same people walking home. I saw like weird cars with weird decals on it. And I felt like during that period, it was starting to form its own identity, which to me, it was very interesting to see. So the thing about my work is that it's always been inspired by my immediate environment. You know, and with all the changes that's been going on in this environment, it will definitely change the way I paint. So for this particular mural, it's called Sing Along If You Know The Words. So if you look closely at the mural, it features my characters dressed up in t-shirts that's actually based on real t-shirts worn by real people that I know. This is actually also a tribute to my friends who have influenced me greatly and inspired me to become the person that I am today. Thank you. So, to me right now, it's all about future-proofing my practice and just doing the best I can with what I have. But at the same time, I know a lot of um, artist friends who had to give up their own art practice because of the pandemic, because they have to make ends meet. I don't know, it's like, I can't help but feel, you know, this, this is just me being a bit selfish about it because I love the arts. I like looking at art. When you have people that you admire stop doing the stuff that I feel that they are meant to be doing, it's a bit sad. But it is what it is. Yeah, you can't really help it. So, for me, I've always loved music. So I decided to try to create some music on GarageBand. I wasn't able to paint um, or I wasn't able to create a picture. I wanted to create the, the sound first or the music first. And then hopefully that will inspire me to create a piece of um, a drawing or a painting based on this particular piece of music. So I'm just going to play a bit. I've always wanted to create a more immersive experience. I wanted people just to see themselves in the painting as well. A bit embarrassing. So everything I've been doing, you know, especially during this period, is trying to create a good song. I don't know whether if I managed to create a classic yet, but that's all I've been trying to do.